So a lot of the things that you think uh, that you hear about ashwagandha are side benefits of sleeping better and decreasing that stress response. But that's where ashwagandha works. I totally forgot that I had talked to a uh, uh, doctor, an OB-GYN, and said that she recommends it for perimenopausal women. Oh, yeah. So it because, does Because, okay, again, going nerdy scientific, the adrenal glands are responsible for both things the stress hormone and the sex hormones, testosterone, progesterone, estrogen, but they prioritize stress. So if you're being chased by a lion, your body yeah. doesn't care that you're ovulating or, there, or that you have testosterone. They care that you can run away <laughs> from yeah. the lion. So your body will always prioritize stress hormones. Puts and more that's value the on the is. stress. Exactly. Than, oh, okay. So that's why uh, as long as your body's always think that it's under attack, and that is stress, everything else is gonna be in the back burner. People like, you know, what happens when you are under stress? Your digestion doesn't work, why? Because your body is sending all its blood to the brain and muscle, so you can yeah. run and focus and get out of there. Yeah, we don't have resources then for that right now. Yeah. digestion is not a priority, sorry. Yeah, then, we uh, can't have you stopping in the exactly. woods to like, the bathroom. That's, exactly, <laughs> that's why you should not eat before you go on a marathon, because you're not gonna digest, Yeah, right? yeah. Your blood sugar goes up because you need sugar, like your blood pressure goes up, but like your, and like your, your sex hormones are not a priority, so that's what happens. So that's why people have to manage their stress. Yeah, I actually did once hear a lion uh, analogy that I really liked. It was, you know, like, we well, we used to be running from lions in the yes. woods. Now the lion is traffic yeah. in our jobs. And, yeah. you know, we still have fear, you know, every day yeah. and stress because, you know, we don't know where that lion's going to show up. But yeah, before it used to be like so that. It was acute. It was like, it comes and it goes. Mm -hmm. Now we have constant stress. Like I said, yeah. it can be biological because the, the, our toxins in the environment, the way that we yeah. eat, we eat a lot of pesticides, that causes stress. Yeah, uh, and then we've got children and, and deadlines. And we mental, yeah. and like we have perceived stress that maybe is not there, so yeah. we oh, live yeah. in a constant yeah. state of stress. Wow. That's where ashwagandha comes. Can help. That, that's why I was telling you that I looked at Google Trends and ashwagandha, like the search for ashwagandha has more than double in the last 12 months. It surpassed green juice, so people, there's an interest. Obviously, people are living under stressful conditions and there's an interest to learn more about ashwagandha. That's why I'm happy that we're doing this because yeah, obviously people want to learn more about it.